Hey friends, we are gonna do a PR box opening because you guys requested it. I have a giant stack of PR boxes that have basically been sitting there since before I went to Chicago and Nashville. So they've just been piling up and piling up and it's just been so daunting to me to like go through all of that. And you guys said on Twitter that you wanted to actually see me open them. So I was like, this is a great excuse to open all these packages and to make a YouTube video out of it. So I thought people were like over these because like these used to be a thing like three years ago and then they didn't do very good uh, with views on my channel or anyone else's. So I thought they kind of fizzled out, but I was really shocked to hear that you guys wanted to see this. So I was like, perfect catalyst to actually get this stack of boxes under control. Oh, I do need to bring a plastic bin for my house here. So when I bring them from the office home, like I've got something to put the stuff in because typically what I'll do is I'll leave everything that I don't want at the office and we'll donate it or anyone in the office can take from it since I'm gonna be moving um, the end of next month. So, um, so yeah, we're gonna, let's head over to the office. No one's there today. So I'm gonna make myself a little espresso and we'll plop down on the floor and open all of the PR boxes. Let's do it. Okay, so <laughs> here are all the products that we have to open today. I swear um, a dress was a really bad idea to wear today, so I'm gonna try and keep the crop of this camera like above the waist, cause I'm sitting on the ground and I was just like, really, oh, I can't reach my espresso. Uh, oh, 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 I almost spilled it. Um, <laughs> a dress was a bad idea. So it's a little hot in here to be drinking espresso. It's like 73 degrees. Hmm. Oh, I'm starting my period today. So like having hot flashes and stuff. Don't mind me, it's gonna be fine. We're all gonna be fine. Okay, so first up we have, I have never been sent anything. Oh, also I wanted to put a disclaimer out there. The address that you see on these packages, if I show you, it's okay. This is my office address. Um, I don't live here <laughs> and uh, it's okay to be shown. So I know a lot of you, um, are super protective and super sweet and thoughtful whenever you see my address on something, you'll tell me quickly, but I know that my address is gonna show, so it's okay. Um, it's actually up on the internet for anyone to see. So I love this package because it says, um, I've never gotten a package from Frank and Frank, uh, was it Frank Body before? And the sticker says, guess what? You'll be naked in a minute. It's so cute, look at that. Okay, so um, let's, maybe I do need to tilt this down a little bit more so you guys can see. Okay, now you can't see my face though. Mm, there's gotta be a happy medium here. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see if I can do this without cutting myself. That would be something. I'm usually a little crazy to get into these. So uh, there's gonna be the most giant pile of boxes. Okay, so we've got a little box. Clothing optional. Oh, whoa, okay. Uh, hey, Kristen, can't wait to meet you in the shower. What? Um, okay, so we have this super cute package right here. This says, follow the call of the disco ball, shimmer scrub, exfoliator for smooth, glowing skin. I'm assuming this is like reusable too, cause it's like a lot in here. So then we have more stuff in here. We have, uh, cherry bomb lip tint. I didn't even know that Frank body made lip tint. Um, and then we have an illuminator. I don't like, I don't know if you, you just use this like on your body. I'm not, I don't know. Um, I gotta put that behind my ear. It's gonna bug me. It's a little bag and we've got some stuff inside. We got a cute little bag and wow, they've really done a lot more with their line since I've seen this last. This is a lip scrub, it's cute. Bird, you need to get lost. I don't need that soundtrack today. Not today, not today, Satan. It's a little bag and we've got some stuff inside. We got a cute little bag and wow, they've really done a lot more with their line since I've seen this last. This is a lip scrub, it's cute. Bird, you need to get lost. I don't need that soundtrack today. Not today, not today, Satan. Uh, okay, and then we have um, creamy face scrub and then we have 
coffee scrub. This is like their original product, I think. And then whipped for your convenience espresso scrub. This is really cute packaging. So yeah, I'm excited to try this out. Next, we have a Too Faced package that is quite large. Too Faced always kind of has like really cool PR packages. So let's see what's inside this bad boy. Gosh, I hate crinkle paper. <laughs> let's see if I can get this out of here without getting crinkle paper all over. Okay, so. Oh no, there's crinkle paper inside. Oh no, there's even more crinkle paper. So here we are. This palette actually kind of reminds me of the, is it called Sugar? Tarte's new um, uh, brand. They did a palette kind of similar to that actually. So this is what we've got. Let's check everything out. We've got the traditional Hangover 3-in-1, um, but this one is infused with watermelon extract. And then we have the Better, the Better Than Sex Mascara. It's just the limited edition version with all the cute like watermelon stuff. And then please tell me these are glitter eyeshadows. Uh, oh, glitter gloss. So we've got three different shades of the glitter gloss. Let's open these up. Gotta be smarter than the package. Smarter than the package. Sadly, that doesn't happen often over here. <laughs> Okay, so these are some pretty neutral shades right here. These are cute. Let's see if they smell like watermelon. Oh my gosh, they do. And then we've got the palette. Let's open this up. Fresh water, oh geez. So it comes with two. So with the two, you make a half a watermelon. Oh my gosh, they're, um, it's magnetic. That's so cute. Melon Dollar Baby looks so nice. It's this green one right here. And then this one is, um, looks like it's bronzer, hi highlight, and blush. We can get rid of that. It's an e.l.f. package. e.l.f. typically has pretty large PR boxes, which I find fun, but also wasteful at the same time. Okay, so this is what's inside. Sounds like everything's breaking. Tear here? Okay. How? Once again, you gotta be smarter than the PR package. Okay. Tear here? It doesn't tear. It doesn't even come off. Okay, well, can't get into this one. One eternity later. Okay, I gave another chance, and I got it. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. Okay, sorry, did you just see my underwear? <laughs> Cute idea, extremely annoying to get into. So, we've got some new e.l.f. brow products. It looks at the top we have a pencil, another brow pencil, or no number one brow pencil in America, and number two, brow gel, brow, brow gel, brow gel, and then powder. So it's basically like everything you need for whatever type of product that you like for brows. We have a box from CoverGirl. Unlock your true blend undercover concealer. Ooh, 30 shades, full coverage. Here's what the box looks like. Um, Rotate the dial to unlock your true blend combination. Oh, that's cool. Oh, cute little package with everything right inside. So there's um, highlight, true blend minerals, loose mineral powder over here. True blend matte made, I love this foundation. Um, and then the concealer. And then what do we have over there? Is that brow stuff? Yeah, we got some brow stuff and a primer. I'm gonna guess that this package is from Huda Beauty. Yep, um, they always come in a DHL package like this. Ugh. Lashes maybe? Lux Silk. Ooh, we've got some new lashes. Introducing a collection of lashes co-created by Huda and her muses. Um, and this one is Lottie number 19. Those look really pretty like nice and fluffy, but still like natural. I like that. Espresso break. 
Oh, too old to be sitting on the floor. This package is from Ofra. What could be inside? Glow Forever. Celebrate the anniversary of our most loved and talked about highlighter. Ooh, okay. I think there's supposed to be a, a product here. Maybe it's somewhere in the package. So this is Rodeo Drive Face and Body Mist. Um, is this like glittery or what's the, oh yeah, look at that. That is really cool. Then we've got a little Rodeo Drive highlight. This is one of my favorite highlights actually. Ofra really knows what they're doing when it comes to highlighter. And, oh, what is this? Rodeo Drive primer. I feel like Nikki had a hand in this. Like. Nikki's the only person that puts like such glittery like primer all over her face and it looks so good every time. Next up, we have It Cosmetics. I haven't seen anything super interesting from It Cosmetics lately. So I don't know what could be in here, but let's check it out. Uh, Lash Blowout. Okay. So this is a new mascara. It's shaped like a round brush. It's interesting. So it says this is uh, the first ever mascara developed in partnership with Dry Bar. Okay, hence the blowout. Uh, brings the benefits of a top hair salon blowout to your lashes. That is just like the weirdest collaboration to me. Like what the fuck does a blow dry bar have to do with lashes? It's just so bizarre. Like that's just really weird. Guess we'll try it and see if it works well, but that is just the strangest like collaboration connection that I think could have been made. <laughs> Next we have Persona Cosmetics. This is um, Sona's uh, cosmetics line. This is what the packaging looks like, pretty cool. And then open it and those are the shades. That's an interesting collection of shades right there. Um, okay. They look pretty. Unique looks really pretty. I like that a lot. These two actually look like my favorite. I don't know um, what cosmetics company this is, but apparently they put the wrong name on here and scratched it off and put mine with a smiley face. <laughs> I'll take it. Oh, this is Feral Cosmetics. Dearest Kristen, thank you so much for all the years of your love and support. I truly appreciate everything you have done for us. We love your spirit, wishing you only the best in life. Um, Okay, so what is it? So they, it looks like they've got some liquid matte lipsticks coming out. I do like the shades that they did. These are really pretty and what they uh, donated to is really awesome too. Um, I'm probably not gonna keep this one or this one. I'm gonna keep those other ones. Next we have Beautylish. I think they messaged me on Instagram and asked if they could send me a package. Okay. Hi Kristen, thought you might love this brand of skincare we have on Beautylish. And I believe, okay, this is really cute package packaging. I think Beautylish has a bunch of brands on their website. It's almost like a, like a, you know, a Sephora kind of a thing, but like online. Um, the packaging is really fun. Um, it's called Good Molecules. I don't know why this camera is not focusing on, yeah, kind of annoying, okay. Um, it's called Good Molecules Instant Cleansing Balm, eye cream, vitamin C, there's tons of products in here. Um, brightening toner, it feels heavy. Like, let's open this up, I wanna see. It's like serious. Oh my gosh, it's like a glass bottle. Okay, so got a bunch of good products from um, Good Molecules, is that what I said it was called? Good Molecules, there's more here. So thank you Beautylish for sending me all this. I'm excited to try. A lot of my skincare is actually packed up right now. So um, I think this is going to be nice to have something, some new stuff on the counter. Cause I've actually been breaking out a lot. Like I'm about to start my period today, so. Oh my goodness, there's even more skincare. 
Um, hyaluronic acid serum, discoloration correcting serum, all these things are speaking to me. <laughs> um, more serums, peptide serum, overnight exfoliating treatment. These all look great. I'm excited to try these. I also really like the packaging, super fun. Next we have Kinder Beauty Box. So Kinder Beauty Box is um, a cruelty free uh, beauty box. And I think it's one of the only ones of its kind. No other beauty boxes are actually um, cruelty free, like fully. Okay. Here it is. And so you get information on everything inside and then you get everything inside and it looks like they're like little um, sample sizes. Here, let me just show you. So everything in the box is cruelty free. I did receive one of these before. Um, and the only thing that I can say about it so far is that it's rad that it's all cruelty free. Secondly, none of the brands that have been in this I actually know of. So if you're somebody that likes to explore new brands that maybe you've never heard of, I think this could be really cool for you. But if you're somebody that likes to be using products and get products from brands that you know and love already, because you know the quality or like whatever, this may not be for you. Um, they've got deep wrapping eye cream in here, a hot oil treatment, um, champagne spray. Uh, I don't really know what that's for. Okay, next we have a box from Profusion. Profusion is one of my favorite brands. I actually discovered them last Christmas when I was in there making like a, I don't know if I, I think I did a video on like stocking stuffers and stuff, but I was just shocked by the price of this brand. And so I just, I just showed my underwear again. Um, I just really liked the, the price point. I think it's great. It's gonna take a second. Do you feel like you've been born again? Cause I do. Uh, Mirage, this is a 35 uh, shade palette. This looks really pretty. They've got some glitter in here. Let me peel this off. There are some shifty shades in there too. This looks really pretty. I love their palettes too because they're clear. So when you're, they're sitting on your shelf or like whatever, you can totally see like what shades you're grabbing. Like. Sometimes the Morphe ones I get frustrated because I have to open every single one. And I love Morphe, but like that is a little annoying, so. Oh my gosh, this is a heavy one. Um, this is from ColourPop. I've seen a few new collections from ColourPop. Honestly, like I love ColourPop to death, but I get so much, um, they, they just put out so many new um, collections all the time. It's super hard for me to keep up. This is so cute. Better than a pot of gold. This is really cute. How about a rainbow collection? How about it? Why not? Face milk in watermelon, papaya, turmeric, matcha, and acai. Looks really cute. This is from um, uh, Fourth Ray, which is owned by ColourPop. Face milk in watermelon, papaya, turmeric, matcha, and acai. Looks really cute. This is from um, uh, Fourth Ray, which is owned by ColourPop. And then we have an overchromatic gel liner bundle. This is really cute. It reminds me of like the crack, uh, I almost said crack packs. I meant crayon packs that you get at restaurants when you're a kid. That's cute. Um, and then there is a BFF volumizing mascara bundle set. These are the colored mascaras and it comes in a set. ColourPop always kills it with the packaging, which I absolutely love. Um, Jelly Much Force, what what is this um so you get these two are the um super shock and then these are the jelly much and it comes in this little kit it's adorable and then there is a brush set oh i expected these to be rainbow they're just white but i don't kind of an odd collection of brushes for mostly like eyeshadow like why would you need this concealer one and then there is a palette. <gasps> oh my gosh, look at this palette. Ah, they like organize this so well. This makes me so happy. Look at that, just look at it. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. I love that. This is a tiny little box. I don't know what's in here. Um. This is Ole Heinrichsen Fat Glow Facial. Um, it looks like this. Instant facial results, no recovery time. 
What is it for? What does it do? Instantly exfoliates and illuminates with PHAs and Nordic birch sap. Does this make my face look fat? Such a weird name. Um, okay. So, reduces the look of pores, dark spots, fine lines, and wrinkles. Instantly exfoliates and brightens. I'm gonna be trying that tonight. Yes, please. Oh, I'm gonna reach for this dose of colors box over here. Let's see what's in here. Q, medium to full coverage foundation. Okay. Ooh. So this is exciting. I don't think that dose of colors has ever had foundation before. So um, these are all of the shades that you can get the foundation in, which looks awesome. Vegan, cruelty-free, talc-free, paraben-free, fragrance-free, oil-free. Um, available in 42 shades, high pigment, matte finish, buildable, lightweight, long wear. And it says our lightweight, medium to full coverage, so it's buildable. Um, delivers a blurring effect, which reduces the appearance of fine lines and skin imperfections. All right. So it comes with a, not it comes with, but this PR package came with a beauty sponge and the foundation looks like this. If it will focus, no, okay, sick. <laughs> um, yeah. I have a package from Beauty Bay. I think that's like Beautylish, right? Is it the similar, similar thing? box oh geez so lots of this stuff in here and then we've got some like little tarot card looking things that explain like what's inside I think like this which is super super cute there are crystals in here there's one I don't know what this is oh it smells so good here is the packaging let's so watch it. Oh, that is really pretty. I don't know if you can see that. It looks really cool. It's like glowing almost. So there's a pink one. I'm just gonna unpackage all these and show them to you all at once. Oh geez, that was close. Almost sliced my finger off. These are the shades. These look really pretty, especially this one. Oh. They look really pretty and glittery. I'm excited to try these. Giant box from NYX. I love the box. That's actually really cool. Pucker up. So this is a bunch of lip lingerie. I love this the whole thing. It's really cute. Um, a bunch of lip lingerie here. It's kind of an interesting package. So find your perfect nude. There's a bunch of different nudes for different skin tones it looks like. And then there's a box inside of the box. Oh my gosh, cute. There's a little neon light of lips. That's adorable. Love it. This is, oh my gosh, it's Lunar Beauty. Yes, I just texted Manny and I was like, I don't have your palette, dude. I don't know what happened. Here it is. Mm. Little insert. Ooh, I'm looking at the back of this. We've got one lip gloss, a liquid lips, two liquid lipsticks, and a 15 shade color palette right there. Oh, this packaging is so cute. This is called Strawberry Dream. Ooh, that's really making me want a strawberry milkshake. I love strawberry milkshakes. Mm. This is so cute. This is like actually sticking up. It's kind of hard to tell, but. Oh. Ooh. This is so up my alley. Look how cool that these, these are like pressed with that, um, the Lunar Beauty logo. Oh my gosh, these are so bright and pretty. Oh, look at this one over here. I don't know if like the camera's picking up just how pretty that is, but I'm super stoked to try this. So these are the liquid lipsticks. That is so cool, look at the top of that. And then this one is the gloss. Goodie. Got a box from Goody. I really hope that these are ouchless hair ties. They're my favorite. Oh, this is cute. <laughs> so this is like a little um, chalkboard that you can write on it. They gave you some chalk. Let's see if I can get it to work. 
kind of works. That's so cute. These are medium thermal round, a uh, large and medium thermal round brush. That's awesome. I've been giving myself blowouts lately, so this could not have come at a better time. Thank you. I opened this recently actually, and I just didn't take it home because it was so big, so I'll show it to you guys. It is a giant package of uh, Smashbox's Studio Skin Full Coverage 24 Hour Foundation. So they provided all of these shades and also setting spray and a photo finish um, primer. And then they give you the package, um, those little envelopes that you just saw me grab down. You put in all the shades that are not your shade and then you send them back and they can do what they need to do with them so it's not wasteful. But this is super cool. I actually forgot this was sitting here. I want to try this out. I think Smashbox has really nailed it in the foundation department. And I haven't been wearing their foundation recently because I've had it all packed. So I definitely need to pull my shades out of here and then ship back the rest. But I'm gonna leave this up here for now. We might actually make it through all these boxes before this camera dies. This package is from Butter London, it says Teddy Girl. Teddy Girl, combining the de defiant edge of Butter London and the rebellious independent decadence of Britain's Teddy, Teddy Girls? Meet the Teddy Girl eyeshadow. What are Teddy Girls? So we got an eyeshadow palette. I don't know what Teddy Girls are. Did anybody from London know what that is? Ooh. And here are the shades. It's a pretty like simple, oh, this eyeshadow. Yes, the camera's not doing this any justice. This is amazing. This is so pretty. Um, this is cute. I mean, this is like pretty tame, but if you are into neutral looks, then this might be something you're interested in. It's like lightweight and stuff, but um, these shades are a little too boring for me. This package is from Seawear. I think I'm saying this right. Uh, Harouche did a collaboration with them. So these are sunglasses and I will pull these out. These are so crazy. These remind me of like Oakley's at like daddy store. <laughs> Ooh, cute. Ooh, cute. I think some of these are a little uh, wild for me. Like I could not pull these off, but congratulations to Harouche and thank you so much for sending these to me. Oh, look at these, these are interesting. I think the only ones I could really get away with are these, but these are really cute. So congrats on your collaboration. I was actually supposed to go up to LA to go to the party, but I just was not able to make it happen. I've just been so busy trying to get everything prepared to move. And it's just been like, you guys know, you already know. Looks like we've got a new eyeshadow palette. Here is the package, so you open it up and there's the eyeshadow palette. This is like such a pretty hollow. It's like pink, I love it. Ooh, this is a really cool palette. Really, really pretty. These on the back are not doing it justice at all. They don't really look like that. They're like really, really pretty. Like, I don't know if you can tell, but some of these are like really shifty, like this one right here. It's really, really, really pretty, I love that. <sighs> This is a package from e.l.f. Again, a little over the top with <laughs> all the extra stuff. Um, so this is a primer infused face primer, hydrating primer, poreless primer. So it looks like it's like a combination of their different primers, oil control primer mist, poreless putty primer, and blurring primer serum. So I'm actually gonna take these out. I'm gonna take the poreless face primer, the blurring primer serum, the poreless putty primer, and the oil control mist, and I'm gonna give the other two away because I don't really have a use for these, and I actually already have this one at home, I think. We've got a Murad package. This is so giant. New to the SPF fam. Um, okay, so we've got, so this looks like all their like SPF products right here. My camera completely died <laughs> the other day when I was at the office doing the unboxing, like that's why it cut off like that. And then I completely forgot to film my outro when I got back, so here is that outro. Thank you guys so much for watching and if you guys want to see like more unboxing videos, let me know in the comments below and by giving this video a thumbs up, that's like a telltale sign for any YouTuber that you're liking that kind of video. 
So I think they're fun. I just, I thought, like I said before in my intro, I thought that they were kind of like, uh, people didn't like them anymore. So I kind of kept them to Instagram stories, but if you guys like to see a little more in depth and kind of like what brands are sending and stuff, maybe I can even get a better setup so I have two cameras you guys could see down in the box when I'm opening it, I don't know. Next time I won't wear a dress, so it's a little easier or skirt or whatever. So it's easier to sit on the ground and open, but let me know what you guys think. If you want to see more, we can definitely do that. I mean, there's no shortage of PR packages coming my way, thankfully. <laughs> so um, thank you guys for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.